Missouri Freedom Drew PMA. Junk. This is my review of Missouri Wind and Solar in the fraudulent business practices they engage in. Magnets are cheap. Rust in no time. Only been used for a couple of months. And this is what happens. Coil. Points on there which is burnt out. In 2013, Missouri Wind and Solar announced the arrival of the Freedom PMG, claiming USA manufacture. The product was also advertised to be the most advanced small wind turbine PMG in its class. This is a, a washing machine motor case. And it, actually you can buy this in any length you want and just cut it up into the desired lengths you need. There's a washing machine motor ends. They don't let enough air through. This is why the coils burn out because they get too hot. Once this rotor starts spinning this section here can't let the air through to cool the rear coil because you've got a hub plate on which stops the air getting in this is spinning and there's nothing to force the air going through these are straightforward magnets high cocking This product is made in Vietnam. Missouri Wind and Solar profits from fraudulent advertising, profiting in the name of the American worker, abusing the trust of the public. So it costs a poor man in England a lot of money and no warranty. So this is what you get from Missouri. So how can this be allowed to happen? The answer is simple. This company sues customers. This company does what it takes to silence the truth. One way trip. It's a bit of everywhere. It's supposed to be stainless steel. That is supposed to be a stainless steel shaft advertising on his videos. Must be very good quality neodymium zinc coated magnets. Look at the thick rust on them. Bearings. All the shouting and advertising he does for these, and they're junk. Freedom PMG is made 100% in Vietnam and is far from the most advanced technology available. So, let's look at the facts. The drawing of the Freedom. In the bottom right corner of the blueprint, the manufacturer's stamp and true origin are exposed. Before you is the fraudulent listing from eBay selling units stating made in the USA. A clear lie. Before you is the truth regarding the origin of the product, and it's not Missouri. Tiny little nut on there. Why didn't they make it with a big shaft, big nut? Aluminium. It all looks nice and thick from the outside. I'm telling them they're all solid. It's a all hollow cast. Sorry for paperweight in it. Documentation from Ennis products to Missouri Wind and Solar. Documentation of tons of important products advertised made in the USA for Missouri Wind and Solar. 
further documentation and falsely advertised goods, Freedom PMG made in the USA 100% of beer to its origin. Missouri Wind and Solar has a history of suing its customers who stand up and tell the truth. If you have been scammed by false origin and output claims of these products, you may be entitled to damages. Freedom dual coil three phase Missouri PMA magnets rust heavily. The vents that claim to cool things down are very, very, very poor. They don't let any air through. The shaft that's supposed to join these two together, which is supposed to be stainless steel, is a mild steel. The coil burns out. I try to use the same bearings as the AC Dell coil to near. The fraudulent listing from eBay selling units stating made in the USA. A clear lie which they claim is no good. So why use the same bearings and the same bearing retainer? And making a case to fit these which is exactly the same as the AC Delco bearing housing retainer. This is supposed to be solid which they say is solid when you open it up. It's all hollow. It's never been uh, coated to prevent rust or corrosion to the aluminium. Copy, that's what it is. It's a washing machine motor ends. That's where these are. It's not purposely made. They found uh, a product which fits in a over washing machine and they've used it. Gotta stay that coil there. No slant coil magnets. The very high cocking. And the plates holding the magnets together are extremely thin. With a big space in between. And these rattle the cells loose. They've never built a stop on there, they're just pressed on. No poor design. The PMA coils. No coating on these. Look almost there. That's just about to burn as well. 